I've looked for a job for many times and then I never find a job. It's difficult. So that was a difficult part to get a job and I've seen that if I can create my own job, it's going to be easy for me to have something to do and to get money and to get food to eat. The reason I want to do a business in Kailicha because people from Kailicha, they go and work in Cape Town, they get paid in Cape Town. And then what they do, they go spend that money in Cape Town. So the economy of Kailicha doesn't grow up. I've run a business before this one and then actually it didn't went well. I was selling meat, I was a DJ, I had a laundry, I had a car wash. My business is in fail on a township. But they didn't grow. Business that I was doing, I had a competition with the other people. We, we said that this is it's a two me market. It's a me too market. Because if I sell caps and then someone's gonna sell caps as well. So that is why we sit down in my partners and said, look. What type of business we can bring in Kailicha? We bring the laundry and then you find out there's five laundries around. How many car wash arounds? A lot. How many people do DJs around in the taverns? A lot. How many people selling meat? A lot. What we can do, let's start a coffee shop. No one is selling coffee. When we start a coffee shop, we had to come in a good way. We had to sell coffee from the beans. We decided to come with something unique. Department of Coffee. It's a coffee shop started 2012, on July the 2nd, and it's here by to bring the coffee culture and Kailisha, more especially like Kekasi, and also to limit the numbers of like uh, jobless and youngsters. And then the beans that you guys use, why the choice of those countries? South America is good on throwing up the beans because they throw uh, most of the beans in high places. That's where by if like um, the beans are in high places, they absorb like uh, uh, a lot of energy in the sun. Here in Malawi, only just because Malawi is uh, the African country, so we're wanting to add some bit of spice, even if our coffee is going to come outside, but adding some bit of spice so that it can be like, um, get the taste of African inside, you know. And then the only thing I know that I won't have a competition. You can start your own coffee shop there, but you will buy my beans at the end. You will use my brand. I'm not talking about business. Sighting a business, Sati Bananum Room, Walk Tong Marie Ingram, or an I organization to try the connect. But Tibana with Nalum Fana was some toilet light in a vision. Okay, from Bailin and from Bailin, Abanya Batin, who went to Papa Shop, a Papa Shop in Nundry, to the Papa Shop, Papa Shop's toilet auction. So Tinagas art is a few things to go. What I can eat the ITA to the ITA to souls as Samela in doing fund as a bone. Samela, I found us Minister of Service Deliver. Bus fund again, Roma, I started a coffee shop. I was 20 years, 19 years, I mean to say so, yeah. I think 19 years by the time I was reaching my first cappuccino. And on that time, I was firstly employed as a casual in a coffee shop called Vida e Cafe. Then I started to drink my first cappuccino, ever. By the time I was holding my first cappuccino, it was like, I have to go and do this thing. And on that time, by the time I was a casual, I was in Scala, watching the dishes, watching those guys. And I was like, watching those guys. They gave me a chance one day. I, made, I'm, I, I did make sure that I, I don't waste that chance. I will make it happen. It's about the research, actually. When you, when you do, when you want to sell a product, you must do a research. We used to go for the whole day trying to find out uh, another coffee shops, what they're doing and stuff. I wasn't taking myself like I'm a master of the coffee shop. I was wanting to be with them so that we can feel the spirit of the vibe. Together and just going on a coffee shop, showing them this is what's happening. Even if we go and buy one cup and then we want to see the three of us. By the time we're doing the marketing, we stand here, I think on the other day it was five o'clock in the morning. Around by eight, we were like imagining plus minus nine to 7,000 people passing by. Taking this coffee concept, bringing it here, we're not knowing who's gonna support a lot. Yeah, we see the people are passing by, but by the time we were standing here, we try to approach and do some marketing outside, free coffee, small cups and stuff. Like we did it like regularly, plus minus, I think we did it 10 times, if I can say so. And uh, after all, like, there's no much people who are buying, like passing by here. What we do, that's where we find our middle slot and we say we bring coffee to the people. I chose this location because my aim was to 
target up all those people who are jumping to the train. But unfortunately, I was supposed as an entrepreneur to have plan B and C. So that if I fail from plan A, then I can use B and C. Instead of like uh, hitting us and, 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 and bring our spirit down, it was like uh, making us powerful because each and every day we're knowing that we have a duty to do. If you're popping into the shop from Monday until Friday, always starting from 8 o'clock until 11 o'clock, you find one guy in the shop. Two guys are running, are, are running out, trying to deliver some coffees. Those city offices, stocks and stocks, Kylie Chakot, Kylie Chakot Hospital, and all those people like in a um, furniture stores in the shops inside the mall and stuff. That's where I will find this look and I said we bring coffee to the people. We can operate this coffee shop just like as a coffee shop that's happening in, in, in Cape Town. There's two areas different. Cape Town is Cape Town, but Kylie Chakot is Kylie Chakot. If I can say, for example, Kylie Chakot shop right is selling like uh, some fed cooks, but you can't find that thing in Cape Town whereby you can find shop right selling some fed cooks. So this is Kylie Chakot in order to make money change up the style you can bring the brand but change up the style so that you can make up some things you can't run it just like in Cape Town it's not gonna work I know that coffee it's not our culture as a black people to be honest you give him an espresso and then she will, or he will go and then have a taste and said ah oh. and then come back and said look I ask you to make me an, an cappuccino and then you give me coffee you can have all these type of coffees you can have a latte you can have an americano you can have a macchiato you can have a chococino you can have a everything on the coffee but I want to tell you, all those coffees come from Espresso. Our idea was to bring the coffee culture into the township. As an entrepreneur, if you, you became an entrepreneur, you must understand one thing, that you will have a challenge from family, from friends. If I can say, like, on my family, my mother was, couldn't understand and stuff. Also, my uncle was, like, saying, why don't you go and, 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 and do the security better? Because, like, this shop of yours is not making money. When you say you don't have cash, did you mean the business doesn't have cash or the person? The business was having cash. In order to, to earn up some salaries, we decided, okay, we're going to take the money and invest it to the business bank. That's the reason why at least now we've got some powers out of these two years so that we can be ready to open our second store. We've been like inspiring a lot of people. Even the time Helen Zilla was here doing up something on the, with the ones who, are, who was catering and stuff, give us a platform to go there, inspire the youth around in Kailicha. We're trying to change the concept of university and technicons, go by and work, get a knowledge, come back and do for yourself. If you want to be the next entrepreneur, be passionate and go outside, learn everything that you can get, make them the combination together and come up with your thing. If your mind is telling you that you can do this thing, go for it. So Sugar and Abankesh could nine Ebsu Gasio Lala car. Yo, so Sugan is all over. I gave him no Sugan is at him. We are the Department of Coffee and we are the Young Premier!